Here's the full story of Tekken's Lily de Rochefort. <sighs> Sebastian, can't you do better than this? Lily made her first appearance in Tekken 5, Dark Resurrection, a next-gen version of the original Tekken 5 video game. She is the only daughter of a wealthy oil field owner based in Monaco, and hence, has had a pampered upbringing. She dislikes losing, spicy food and sweat. Likes winning, sweets, tea, and Ganryu's eyebrows. Four years ago, Lily was kidnapped and held for ransom, but the daughter of the rich businessman managed to break free all by herself and took out one of her kidnappers as well. This is where she realized she had a real passion for street fighting. Mr. de Rochefort was a good man who disliked conflict, so as a means to not upset her father, Lily pretended to be on vacation while taking part in various fighting tournaments all over the world, accompanied by her butler, Sebastian. One day, Lily received a tournament invitation from Forrest Law, an opponent she once defeated in San Francisco. She soon realized that the organization hosting the said tournament was none other than Mishima Zaibatsu, a strong rival and a source of many headaches for Mr. de Rochefort. She decided to enter the competition to free her dear father from his problems. Lily was unfortunately defeated by Asuka Kazuma, and after her father learned of her fighting against his wishes, she was prohibited from leaving the Rochefort residency, deeming her unable to have a much-desired rematch against Asuka. How awful. My first day at school is completely ruined. In Tekken 6, Mr. de Rochefort's oil fields were taken over by Mishima Zaibatsu. This completely destroyed Rochefort Enterprises, which caused Lily's father to have extreme anxiety, and so he ultimately collapsed. Lily couldn't stand to see her father in such pain, and as a way to relieve him of some stress, she started scheming a way to somehow take back the oil fields from Mishima Zaibatsu. That's when the organization announced the Sixth King of Iron Fist Tournament, a perfect opportunity for already prepared Miss Rochefort. Lily started searching for Jin Kazama, disguising one of her father's tankers as a yacht. At some point, she was defeated by Lars and Elisa in Queen's Harbor, and ultimately gifted them an SUV she deemed hideous. Lily expressed her disappointment over not being able to have a rematch with Asuka Kazama, and before heading back to Monaco, told Lars to finish off Jin Kazama. Otherwise, she'll kill him. Or else, I'll kill you. Lily once again entered the seventh King of Iron Fist tournament without notifying her father. The girl who grew up with a silver spoon in her mouth was dead set on fighting Asuka Kazuma, an opponent she considered her greatest rival. In fact, Lily took the courtesy of signing up Asuka for the tournament and called her up to inform her about the current situation. Miss Rochefort received what she desired so much, and she couldn't be more thankful for it. While it's unknown who ended up being victorious, after the battle, Lily, without any sort of invitation, decided to move into Asuka's house and learn Kazuma-style traditional arts. Not only did Lily buy Asuka's family home, but also her father's dojo, which was on the verge of bankruptcy due to losing so many students. During the seventh tournament, Lily also suspects that a thousand-year-old vampire that slept for 600 years beneath her family's estate is her sister, a speculation that Eliza herself denies. But before she can explain her relation to the de Rochefort family, she falls asleep. The de Rochefort family and I. In Tekken 8, along with Lily, her new pet named Salt makes an appearance. Salt is a Siamese cat, who even makes sure to celebrate victories with its owner. While we see Lily face off against Asuka, it seems that their childish rivalry has to now be set aside due to the serious global threat that the G Corporation poses. To Paris. 